The painting of Madonna with the long neck is Parmigino's painting, which is defined by spatial composition and elongated figures. This 85-inch by 52-inch oil painting was painted in 1535 and is unique because of Madonna's swan-like neck. Within this painting, Madonna, who is clothed in beautiful robes, is seated on a high pedestal holding baby Jesus on her lap. To the left of Madonna are four angels who are mildly looking upon Jesus. To the right of Madonna is St. Jeremy, who, compared to the rest of the people in the painting, is proportionally small. The reason the length of Madonna and her son's limbs are so exaggerated is because they are symbolic of the painting's religious value. Madonna appears to be more elegant and graceful because of her elongated neck, shoulders, and fingers. Her curly hair, which is decorated with pearls, frame her face, and she is dressed in a flowy robe. Christ is shown lying across Madonna's lap in a pose that resembles death. The angels seem to be compacted together on the left side of Madonna, while the right side of her is open except for the small figure of St. Jeremy. This takes away the equilibrium of the painting. During the Mannerist movement in which Madonna with the long neck was painted, spatial incongruency and elongated forms were common in paintings of Andrea del Sarto, Gepaco Portorma, and Razzo Fariento. This period of art developed around 1520 in Florence and or Rome, and, is replaced, and it has replaced the High Renaissance era. The Mannerist movement lasted until the 1580s. This painting was originally owned by a noble woman named Elena Bacardi. Since Madonna and her child were a popular depiction during the Renaissance, she wanted Parmigianinos to paint Madonna for a family chapel called Santa Maria de, de Servia in Parma. Parmigianos worked on it for six years but never finished it because of his death in 1540. It can now be seen at the Galleria De Healy Uffizi in Florence, Italy.